Uh, so Paul, 4-3 win over Wimborne. Uh, how could you put that into words? I think we got away with one, to be honest with you. Um, to score four goals away from home, you'd expect to be comfortable. Um, I didn't like us. I didn't like us at all. It probably maybe a little bit leggy from Saturday. Um, I didn't think our attitude was quite right um, all through the game and, and things weren't going our way. Wimborne played well. Wimborne played really, really well. And, and we didn't play well. So, but to score in the last minute shows last seconds. You know, on Saturday we got it because we conceded in the last seconds. Tonight, we're happy because we score in the last seconds. But so we've got away with one, but we haven't got away with one for a long time. So it's a big three points for us. Um, but we just <laughs> spoke about it in there. We listen. Don't no one think that we're we're happy about the performance. Delighted with the delighted with the three points. Absolutely made up. But that was a tough night. And when you went one 0 up early on, did you think? Can we can yeah. maybe hit a few more goals? Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. Um, we we fancied ourselves from set pieces, and we ended up scoring three goals from set pieces. Um, when we went one 0 up, you couldn't you couldn't ask for a better start. And then you think, go on then, go and score the second and the third because it was there too. But then we, we allowed Wimborne back in the game, and fair play to them. They they played some good football. Um, the goal on half time gave us a bit of impetus. Made a couple of changes at half time, which worked. Um, give us an energy on the pitch. Um, and like I said, we got away with one, mate, so it's not always perfect football, is it? What was your message to the player at half, players at half-time? Obviously, they got the goal to make it 2 all going into the break, but yeah. obviously you weren't particularly happy at half-time? I didn't, I didn't like us first half. I didn't like us before the game, Cam. I didn't like us on the bus on the way up. It all felt... I, I think some players thought we were just going to turn up and win. We ain't good enough to do that. We're nowhere near good enough to do that. Mm. I ain't good enough and the players ain't good enough, so... We, we have to be honest every game. We have to be at it. We have to work hard. Um, it just wasn't it wasn't our night, and it felt like everything was dropping to Wimborne. Every decision was going for Wimborne, but we persevered, mate, and we we got. I wouldn't say our just rewards, but we got you know kept plugging away. And Rocky's great finish at the end. I mean, Tyler scored another two, so there's loads of positives. But I think we've got to be honest with ourselves. I, I try and be really honest. I'm not going to sit here and kid anyone on and say we deserve to win because we didn't. But we've played games this year. We've lost and didn't deserve to lose. So, football's it, you know, it happens. I know we, we don't really want to talk about the opposition too much, but uh, Wimborne, do you feel like, like they're in a false position really at the bottom? Well, I don't. I mean, the league's strong this year. Mm. The league's really strong. Kings Langley are down near the bottom and gave us a real tough game. Wimborne played some of the best football we've we've played against. P- play football the right way. Mm. Um, so, if they're in a false position, I, I, I don't really know. We haven't played everyone in the league yet. But um, they gave us a that was a horrendous night, tough night for us. And although perhaps the performance wasn't what you wanted, do you think the comp- that obviously the confidence boost that will give with the last last minute winner <laughs> and know. going into you said that you wanted it on Saturday that you had the uh, you had the, the late goal and you're saying if we'd have come here get three points and four four points out of possible six well, that, two tough away I games. Said, I just said to the boys in there we <clears throat> after Saturday we, we said we wanted four points and two away games which is which is good at any standard of football mm-hmm. and we got that. So I think it might be a night of just getting on the bus and going home and, you know, it's what it is.